The call to action button is the eye-catching element on your page that entices visitors to click on it in order to take action on your offer. This template already includes one for you, although a call to action button can easily be added within the design block section of the menu. Once your call to action button is added, you can make changes to it by clicking on the elements, which would open up a menu on the right side of the screen. In the design tab, you can change the visual elements of your button. For example, the text size, color, alignment, and other attributes that you can explore right here. However, what we want to do right now is to click on configure so we can actually set up what happens when someone clicks on your call to action button. In this configure tab, you will first have the option to set what you want the button text to say. Enter in your preferred call to action phrase, which would ideally be specific to the action that you want your visitors to take, and this text will appear on the button itself. For link to, this will tell the system what to do when somebody actually clicks on the button. For example, you can choose from pop-up, none, meaning nothing will happen, page, block, or URL. In our example, we want to take visitors to our GrooveFunnels affiliate link. If you're unsure how to find your affiliate link, refer back to our tutorial called Get Your Affiliate Link in the Groove Partner Program walkthrough series. Although in summary, it's quite simple. All we need to do is go back to GrooveJV.com. Within your promotion tools, click on Links, and you will find your affiliate links right here. I will copy my affiliate link, then go back to Groove Pages and paste in the URL in the appropriate section. When you have done this, click on Update. Note that if you have multiple buttons on the page, you will want to repeat this process for all of them so that visitors will be able to access your affiliate page regardless of which button they click on. 